Hi, my name is Ryan Crapo and I'm the principal bassoonist of the Houston Symphony. I'd like to invite you to take a tour of my studio. When I'm working from home, I split my time between three little areas. This is my practice chair and stand. This is my reed desk. And this is the table where I do cane processing. Let's take them one at a time. In my practice area, I have my bassoon stand. On my shelf, I have all the necessary items so I don't have to keep getting up to get more things. I have my metronome and my tuner and my other tuner and a pencil eraser and a pair of pliers to adjust the wires on my reed. I have, let's see what I have here. I have some Bach. I love practicing Bach. It's technically and musically demanding. This is one of the cello suites. I have an arpeggio etude. I have an etude that slowly winds its way through all of the keys, major and minor. I have a piece by Henri de Dieu. I'm practicing that hopefully, eventually we'll be able to perform that. That's for piano and bassoon. I have the White Whale, this etude by Pierre that is probably impossible to play at tempo, but it's fun to practice anyway. My reed desk is where I do all of my um, reed finishing and construction. I have all the tools that I need just within easy reach. All these guys, pencils, pens, markers. These are some that are getting close to being finished there. If you've made it into the box. There's some day one, day two, day three. Obviously I need to fill these guys up pretty soon here. More tools. Our season calendar. Intonation help. These are reeds that are awaiting their turn. Drying out. And my goggles. I can see tiny things. This table is where I keep piles of reeds that need to be worked on and also store all of my uh, cane processing machines. So as you can see on the desk, we make all of our reeds by hand and it's quite a time-consuming process and requires a lot in the way of machines. So these reeds are in various stages of being completed. I've got some over here. This is one of my machines. It's a profiler. I have other various machines under here that aren't actually being used at the time. I have a food dehydrator that I use fairly regularly. I keep cane in here after I've done some work on it so that it doesn't get moldy in this lovely humidity here. Thank you for spending part of your day with me today. Hope you enjoyed looking around my studio. I can't wait to get back to Jones Hall and I'm really looking forward to seeing you all there. Bye.